There's no doubt that the Hubble Space Telescope has completely revolutionized our understanding of the universe. And we're building the James Webb Space Telescope to be the scientific successor to Hubble. James Webb is really focusing on not only our solar system, but it's also looking out into deep space. It's going to be at the second stable Lagrange point. That's about 1.5 million kilometers from the Earth, which actually equates to almost four times the distance of the Earth to the moon. And it's going to be looking at very, very old, old light to see the first galaxies, first stars, first planets that were ever formed. As a scientific successor to Hubble, we're building the James Webb Space Telescope in a little bit of a different way. The Webb Telescope is much larger than the Hubble. It has seven times the collecting area of Hubble. It works at longer wavelengths than Hubble works at. So we start with visible light, red light you could see, but we go out to 28 microns wavelength, which is much longer than your eyeball can pick up, and that's heat radiation. The Hubble Space Telescope, its mirror is one circular mirror, but in order to build a telescope that's as big as the James Webb Space Telescope, we have to be able to fold it up and put it inside the rocket. So if you look at the primary mirror, there are these 18 different mirror segments that fit together and that fold up. Once we launch the telescope, the deployments start fairly soon, hours after launch, and then the telescope itself takes a few months to get out into that deep part of space. And then once it's out there, we'll have a few more months of sort of checkouts, um, calibrations, letting the instruments turn on. So it'll be about six months after launch uh, when we first do the first science observations. The history of Hubble sort of showed us that you really, when you, when you have new capabilities, you just don't know what to expect. I am absolutely convinced that this telescope uh, once again is going to change the way we understand the universe.